Welcome to Fair Game. I'm Christine Leahy. My guest today is part of a comedy family that is just royalty. He's an actor, writer, producer, and director. Stop it. Not to mention, he's an all-around funny guy. Oh, too much pressure. Damian Dante Waynes is here. Were you just miming? Were you miming your yeah, that intro? Was, that was, you know, like when you try to be humble yeah. and you don't want to receive it all, but it That's feels so good. That's not what you were doing. No, it just felt so oh, good. Oh, okay. It made me feel it warm and good. fuzzy. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so, you, I, like I just said, you are a part of a very, very funny family. Uh -huh. When you guys get together, how do you get a word in? You don't. You don't. <laughs> it's impossible. It's too many. But to be a fly on the wall, that would be quite interesting. Can I be a fly on the wall to you your absolutely next, can your be next a fly do like a dinner? What do you guys do together? Yeah, well, here's the thing. You know, we never had a family reunion. Why? Ever. How? I, I think because... You need t-shirts made. Exactly. I think it just becomes so much of a production. Like, we don't even have Christmases anymore. What? Yeah. Now we just rent out like a bowling alley and just invite everybody oh, there you and call it like Wayne's cool. Day. You guys got too cool, didn't you? No, you guys no. You are all too famous. It's just too many. It's There's just, too, okay. like, y'all might be Wayne's. Oh, come on. One of you guys has a huge house where you can fit all of you. Well, um, yeah, but... Who's got the biggest house? Oh, uh, maybe on, Uncle Damon? Uncle Damon, he yeah, does. Well, he should host that. Christmas. He should. I feel like But he's fair. Jehovah's Witness. Look at that. <laughs> you got, you got me We're there. coming to your house. All right. Oh, you want to come to my We're house? We're coming to your I'll house. I'll gladly host the Wayne's family. Done I'll even deal. cook for you. Done. Okay, here's one thing you guys all did together. This is a, uh, you guys, paint paintball. <laughs> I mean, how many teams does that make up? That's, that's not the, even like one team or two th teams. That's a good solid maybe four teams right there. Can okay, I, who's the best paintballer? Ooh, uh... <laughs> <laughs> Not me. Um, I would say maybe Marlon, because he just wants to shoot everybody, even people on his team. Uh, that's not how you play. That's not how you um, play. Who's the worst? Uh, probably Marlon, because he wants to shoot everybody oh, on his team. Oh, the best and the worst. <laughs> yes, oh, he's the okay. best and the worst. All right. Um, so the Waynes brothers are your uncles. Yes. I'm going to put you on the spot here. Who's funnier? Oh, out of the uncles? Yeah. Because there's a funnier one in the family more so than them. Who's that? My grandmother. Your grandmother. My grandmother, that makes sense. She is the funniest, but she's the funniest when she's angry. Give me an example. Uh, she, my grandpa pisses her off, she'll curse him out in the funniest way possible. Like what makes her mad? Um, anything my grandpa does. <laughs> <laughs> I, tell me. Um, he could come like, in. Like, I want to hear one of her rants. Like, what does she say? Uh, it's, it's hard to duplicate her funny because it's okay. so specific to her anger. So I would be, ah, I couldn't do her service. I couldn't right. do her good justice. Is that where the whole family gets it from? Absolutely. Gra okay. Grandma. So who is the funnier of your uncles? The funnier of my yeah. uncles. <sighs> Ooh, that's a tough one. That's because it's like a combination of. Are all... you trying to be nice right now? I am trying to be very nice. We don't need to be nice. You know, here. I'm trying not to get kicked out the family. <laughs> they were gonna kick you out of the <laughs> family. I'll for be that? gone. I'll be gone. Oh gosh. Yeah. Well, you've been in this industry since you were seven years old, and your big first role was in Eddie Murphy's Raw. Wow. Someone did their research. That's what I do. Ooh. How'd that happen? Uh, I remember how that happened. Um, I remember my uncle Keenan. Uh, being cool with Robert Townsend, who was a director on it. Um, he told me to come in for an audition. My audition was 10 push-ups. And I think I made it to nine, and he said, give him the part. Really? Yes. Can you do a good push-up? Um, I would like to think so. Like all the way chest down to the ground? I mean, I, I, you know, you are looking at a vessel. Oh, excuse and, me. And uh, within this vessel, we have core strength all up in here. Uh -huh. I know you got a lot of athletes on this show. I do, yes. But um, in terms of push-up for push-up, I'll, I'll go toe-to-toe -to -toe with You can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with any of the athletes. Any of them. I feel like that is a competition we need to have happen. <laughs> hey, T.O., where you at? Who, who's here? <laughs> LeBron, where you at? Oh, yes, LeBron. That would be a good one. <laughs> Um, so Tatiana Ali was mm. on this sketch with you. Yes. And I heard that you tried to impress her. Well, you know, Tatiana was my first crush. Oh. I gotta be honest. Um, you know, there was a, a moment in time where um, she had a little lemonade stand during production. And, yeah. Uh, I tried to flirt with her and it didn't go so well. So years later, um, I had this show that I uh, was producing for BET called Second Generation Wayne's, uh -huh. and I casted her, thinking oh. that was gonna be my Wait, you end. casted her specifically? Yes. Oh, well, wow. Well, and she's an amazing actress. Oh, yeah, But okay, I just okay. felt like, you this know, now you end. can see my elevation. Yeah, I look grew. at me now. Look at me now. Started from the bottom. And she still played me. Oh, I love you, Tatiana. She though. played you? Well, no, 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 she didn't play me, but she played me. <laughs> How, what happened? Um, You're like, remember me in the lemonade stand. I literally said that. Do you remember me at the lemonade stand? And she said, uh, no. Oh, no. <laughs>
<laughs> Did you try uh, maybe asking her on a date? Never that. Never Why? that. You That's know, how it, you do it. You can't mix business with pleasure. Oh. Come on now. Well, you no. just told you me that you hired that. her because you yes, wanted another shot. Because I wanted her to see me in a different light, oh. thinking that would help if the mm. show ever got canceled, and it did, mm. and she still didn't. But it's, you know, I digress. I'm not holding any of this in <laughs> at so, all. So the show is called Second Generation Wins. Mm -hmm. um, you are part of this big family, you're trying to break out of the shadow. Mm -hmm. Is that like real life for you? Um, well, with Second Generation, we try to tell that narrative. We try to show how there's a certain perception that people have of the Wayans family. And because you're born in the family, that it's just turnkey, the industry. And it's really not. You know, there's a lot of ups and downs, peaks and valleys mm -hmm. as to any gig and any yeah. job in Hollywood in general. Sure. So we wanted to show that on the show. Okay. Yeah. What's the hardest part for you being a Wayans family member? Um, that I'm not them. You know, I'm my own individual, even though my name sounds like four or five of them. There's a Damon <laughs> Jr., there's a Damon Sr., and there's a Damien, but we all are our own different individual, you know what I mean? Yeah. The, um, one way in success is all way in success, but at the end of the day, we're all our own man. Has it woman. ever cost you a role? Um, I, I believe it did. Um, there was a there was a moment where I went in for an audition, and you can see on the casting director's face, this is the wrong one. Oh no! <laughs> you can just feel um, that's not Marlon. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> but you had to, you know, muster through. You had to, you got to do your thing. You also got to direct, right? A few yeah. episodes of My Wife and Kids. Yes. Do you take advantage of that opportunity to boss around your uncle? You can't. Why? He'll fire you. He'll fire you? <laughs> Absolutely. Uncle Damon will oh, get fired. Oh, he's soft. Yeah. <laughs> he's soft. You couldn't boss him around? Um, you know what? I, I think the, the perk within that is that I know my uncle so well, so I knew when he was moody, or I knew when he needed to eat lunch, or I knew, you know, just get that taken, keep it pushing, you know? So those little things, I think, gave me a little slight edge. You gotta know when he's hungry? You know, you gotta know when talent's hungry. That's, you know, you, you want to. That's you, true. You, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yes, I get hungry. <laughs> you see sometimes. what I mean? And I'm sure the crew would be like, oh, she's hungry. Oh. <laughs> They're like, whatever. <laughs> we'll feed her later. Um, okay, if there's gonna be a movie about the Wayne's family, which I'm sure one day there will be, right? Mm -hmm. There has to be. What role would you want on that production? What role would I want? Yeah. Um, what role would I want? I would just want my lines to not get cut out. Oh, you would want to be the act an actor, uh, Yeah, I would want to okay. be an actor on it. And, and you know, just, just your some, goal is to just not have your lines cut out? Cut out? You, you know, there's oh. a lot of talented actors you in the You gotta shoot fan. for the stars. But what you gotta do is you gotta go hierarchy, right? So yeah. Uncle Ivory has to decide what role he want. Then Uncle Keenan, then Uncle Damon, then you got Maul, and then you got Sean. It's just so many oh, before man. they get to you. I just want lines. What, what number do you rank on the... Family it's a totem lot. pole. 9,376. Oh, jeez. Yes. Okay. And counting. More there was a Wayans born today. <laughs> After this interview, I'm rushing to the hospital. <laughs> <laughs> More with Damien Dante Wayans when we come back. Check out our YouTube channel, Fair Game, on FS1 to catch all the best highlights of our show. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button so you never miss an episode.